Carnival in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil The Carnival in Rio de Janeiro is a holiday conducted every year before Lent. It is regarded as the world's largest carnival, with 2 million people on the streets on any given day. The Entrudo was introduced to carnival in Brazil in 1723 by Portuguese colonists from Thay. Islands of Acos, Madeira, and Cabo Verde. People walked out into the streets and soaked each other with buckets of water, hurled mud, and threw food at one another, resulting in street brawls and riots. Carnival began as a pagan holiday in ancient Egypt, and was later adopted by the Greeks and eventually the Romans. The popular festival was renamed the Carni Whale Festival by the Roman Catholic Christian Church. In Europe, Carnival is the merrymaking and revelry that occurs in many Roman Catholic countries in Thay. Days and hours leading up to the Lenten season. The word's origin is unknown, however it could be traced back to the medieval Latin car name. Lava or carnelivarium, which meaning, to take away, or, to remove, flesh. Because samba is such a fast and rhythmical dance. It's crucial for dancers to be comfortable while dancing and to be able to move and cool down. With minimal clothing, to offer the dancers more flexibility to dance and to make them feel lighter, the legs, arms, shoulders, and torso areas are revealed or exposed. The Carnival Samba Costume, perhaps the most important in Samba dance tradition is worn by professional samba dancers known as passisters. The costumes are made of rich materials like pheasant feathers and Swarovski jewels to reflect their beautiful movements. It's the world's greatest carnival festival, with millions of people flocking to the city for a week of flashy, samba-shaking joy. As COVID-19 continues to wreak havoc across Brazil, the mayor of Rio de Janeiro has officially postponed Carnival, saying that the celebration would be celebrated with all the intensity we deserve in 2022. Carnival in Rio de Janeiro in 2022 will take place from February 25 to March 5, 2022. It was last postponed in 1912, when José Paranhas, dubbed the father of Brazilian diplomacy, died just a week before the celebration. The government decided to postpone Carnival until April at the time, and 20,000 people instead turned out to observe Baron Ho's funeral procession. Hope you liked the video. We have more than 150 videos on trending places. Do like and subscribe. Keep watching.